Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Victoria 2, playing as Japan. So, the end of last time, we wanted to go to war with Omen, but then now the British are involved. I really don't want to get involved in a war with the British, especially with our holdings, our colonial holdings, our state holdings, so very far apart. So, I'm just going to white peace out if I can, and have a status quo for the most part. I don't mind if, if I lose just a little bit of... I lose... 59 prestige. That kind of sucks, to be honest with you. But, I think that's it's just for the best. Whatever, you know. We lose a little bit of prestige. We're still ranked 6th? Oh, we have more militancy and consciousness, but that's not actually a bad thing. We can do reforms, which is exactly what I've been wanting to do for a while, actually. Because you can get better healthcare for more population growth or immigrant attraction, which I really don't care about immigrant attraction. But, oh, we could more political awareness. Nope. I love getting more education efficiency. I love it, love it, love it. But let's get more healthcare because we need a massive population. And look at that army. We can make more soldiers, which is exactly something that we're trying to do right now in Japan. Proper. So we lose a little bit of prestige. You know, whatever. It's better to be done with that right now. Anyways. Germany's interesting. They're ranked two in the world, but they're number one in industry. They also have Luxembourg as an ally. They don't have them in their sphere. Who's in the Luxembourgish sphere? Fear. No one. I believe. Nope, Russia. I believe that if Ger the North German Federation, if they can get Luxembourg in their sphere, and when they make Germany, Luxembourg will be annexed, I think. I think. Could be wrong on that. I could be very wrong about that, but whatever. So, we IYP style just makes it easier for us. So, instead. Instead. How about we go have a good time with Guangxi? Now, obviously, we don't have enough infamy for this yet. Could demand a concession. Five infamy, so we gotta wait a, just a little bit longer. Are we making any more divisions? Afghanistan was annexed. Very cool, very, very cool. Now that's a good ally. Oh, they're fighting the Russians and Punjab. Very cool. Let's see, we need more divisions. Telephones, very cool, very good. What do we need to do with telephones? Telephones need electronic gear and glass, it looks like. Yeah, it looks like glass. So they need coal. So we need coal, steel, coal and steel electronic factories. Coal, steel, electronic factories for the most part. Do we have coal, steel? We oh, got some iron there. Do we have a steel factory here? We might have one in Pyongyang. What do we have in Pyongyang? In Pyongyang, we don't have. We have almost nothing. Uh, let's get a telephone factory going. Let's get a steel factory going. Do we need anything else? We need glass. That'll be good to do as well. Look at that. Railroads help your factory throughput, which is great. And we're doing that. Cement. Cement. Do we need cement? Explosives. You're going to make steel here. Bullets. Ammo. Hmm. Ste oh, we might as well build a steamer shipyard here then. Just so we get, we've got coal and steel going to be built here, so that'll be actually pretty important. And before we, let's go on a little bit, a little slowly, about half speed. We could probably lower this by a little bit for now. Lower this by a little bit as well. That'll be good, and it's costing us quite a bit of money to make our new stuff. Nice, very good, very good. Trying to make another army group with two cavalry, interesting. 20 steamers, convoys, transports, very good. Can I make any sort of navy? I really don't want to make ironclads, 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 or man of wars, or monitors. I really just want to make dreadnoughts. I really don't want to get into too much naval battles. That looks like a lot of fun. We need to definitely do military staff system. So, like I said last time, we get some gas attack in 1900. But we have quite a bit of time before we can we need to go there. So we can probably wait on a lot of the stuff. Throughput, looms, comp production. Huh. This stuff is honestly probably pretty good stuff that I need to do. But we can maybe, maybe wait just a little bit longer. I just more attack, more forts. Forts are nice. Get more... Eh, actually, strategic... Uh, let's do this. Let's get more army organizations so we get better, you know, cavalry. Because I'm still using just literal cavalry. Uh, let's talk about the extra team. Why not? Anything else we can do here? Help feed the poor. Very cool. Oh, there it goes. I can make that. 
Okay, you know what? Battleships? Battleships are cool. Battleships are decent, but we need a level 4 port or greater. Which means I need... Am I not building a level 4 port? Oh, we are building a level 4 port. Nice. We got that done. Supply range, naval professionalism. I'm just kind of thinking right now that we're going to go to war with China eventually again. Well, southern China. So, that'll be good. That'll be very, very good. Look at that population. Look how... We have 22 million people in our population here. 43.56% is Japanese, which is really cool. Brunei. We're trying to get more... Uh, uh, bureaucrats. That's the B word I'm looking for. Bureaucrats. Especially in Korea. Because I want to make sure they have enough bureaucrats eventually. Ooh. No one wants to be a conservative. Alright, well, whatever. Maybe they'll give us more reforms. That'll be good. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Formosa. That'd be nice. Great. Um, clean coal. Mechanical production sounds pretty good. Let's use that. And these are, like, all... <clears throat> Relatively earlier text, so it's not too bad to just do it really quickly. See what's happening here. Demobilize. Alright. Uh, darn it. They were annexed, but now Persia had to release them. That makes sense. Whatever. Whatever. What can we do here? Very nice, very nice. If we uh, diplomacy Mongolia. Hum Are they allied with. That's a big Mongolia. We don't even have black access to them, and they're allied with the Chinese. No, they're allied with Tibet. And the Russian sphere. I don't want to mess with Russia, like I said before. Uh, we can expand our factories more. Because we're never going to be number one in industry. <clears throat> but, you know, if we're, if we're five, I, I feel pretty comfortable with that number. Just got to make sure we keep, keep that. Good, good, good. Especially in Pyongyang, because that could, that could be a very strong industrial center for us. Good, 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 good. And I know Japanese Hokkaido needs definitely more craftsmen. You know, I might just ask for craftsmen here already. Get craftsmen from... Mm, Borneo. Let's do that. Cool. Speed up time a little bit more. Cool, cool, cool. Awesome. We're really not making a lot of money now. It's costing us so much here. Oh, look, looks like Poland, perhaps? So the biggest thing that's costing us money, education is pretty costly, but this definitely. Can goods, ammunition. So, oh, we get, ooh, we get rubber. Rubber. I always call it rubber so far in this campaign. I'm just going to call it rubber from here on out. Let's make tomorrow's stockpile purchase will cost quite a bit. Oil. Nice. Good stuff. Let's pause the game real quick, because I want to read this. So... Apparently, we can't satisfy our need for canned goods, it looks like. Ammo, small arms, or explosives. So, what about ammo? Oh, s what's going on here? Not in high demand. Huh. And I do have a cup of green Japanese tea here. Let's see. That looks pretty decent. Not in high demand, which honestly makes it a pretty good time for us to buy it up. There's going to be a lot more demands for a lot of other things. Automate? That's fine. In high demand. Are you sure? It looks like the price has dropped quite a bit. Machine parts. Alright, let's take a look at this. What's this crisis going on? Poland demands this from the Russian Empire. Oh, I thought that was Germany. Um. Sorry, man. I'm really not interested in European affairs. Colonial incident. Let's see. An invasion through there and blood the troops. I'm so interesting. Get against that. Jingoism. Ah, uh, get more Jingoism. Yeah, good. We failed to enlist. Because Pol- that, Yeah, that's right there in Poland. Oil! Ah, uh, Oh, my goodness. Factory throughput. Great. Interchangeable parts. Jigs. Factory output mining. Practical steam engine. Uh, that's okay. This stuff. Pit coal. Coal production. It's less than 5,000 research points, so I feel pretty good about doing this. Cool. Alright, so, I've got U9 here. You guys will probably come to Hainan. And... Oh, we're making another army down here. Or is it... Down there. Oh, this is this is another army I was trying to make at the same time. Uh, oh, are we done building? No, we got a few more guys we want to pute out. Make this one big ol' army here. Kinda cool. Even though it seems a little bit too big for my liking. 
The violence in Sinai? Eh, I just I'm gonna kill them off. You know what? I might just do this too. Oh, good. Grievous insults. Options are limited. Yeah, Burma. Oh, I can't make these guys yet. Military staff systems. Why am I doing clean coal then? I'm gonna reintegrate them for now. It's fine. It's better than nothing. Beercrest slowly going up. Formosa. We relatively conquered it relatively early ish. Okay, now we get Hussars. Interesting. Which one is best? Let's double check. Let's see. You have two. Actually, Hussars might be the best. Yeah, I think the Hussars are the best cavalry until you get planes. So, Asia. Japanese Hussars. Japanese Hussars. And let's go pull out those cavalry again. Thank you. Very nice. Alright, so. You guys. I'm going to need you over here, actually. And then you guys could probably come over here. Oh, and they got a lot of guys around here. Can I build an army here? Oh, yeah, I can. Let's get some Chinese conscripts. So. So, we got two artillery. And an engineer. So, we need one, two, three. Get a Hussar. Uh, I can't even remember what I'm doing now. I think it's, yeah. One, two, grab one more. Nice, that's almost good enough. Factory output, great. Cassus Belly, Cassus Bell Eyes, whatever. Ah, uh, good. And let's grab military statistics. Oh, we have to actually unlock it as a technology process, that's right. For cursors and other stuff like that. Hey, actually, it doesn't really matter since we have what we need already from those guys. Oh, yeah, expand the naval port. That'd be good. Let's see. Supply is amazing right now here. I don't mind building up an infantry. An infantry. And I lied about that infantry. I want a Hussar. I might just throw him onto that group right here. That'd be good. Can we build up ports anywhere else? Ports, 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 ports. Yes, Mogadishu. Japanese Somaliland. Saigon, you're looking pretty darn good. Thon, Hoa, you guys looking pretty awesome, pretty awesome right there. You guys looking pretty delightful over here as well. You have maybe a little bit too much, um, too much guys around here. Get rid of those guys. Are those anarchists? They might be. Well, let's double check. Anarcho liberals. Oh god, dang it, anarcho liberals. That's fine, whatever. Let's get ready for this. Let you guys get. Strained up first. We get dye factories. Ningbo is still working on their stuffs. So is that place. Oh, yeah. How many brigades do we have? 48,000 divided by 3 is usually 16,000. So 16. We need 16 transports, which means that's going to be good. But I need battleships. 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 They're all level 3 ports. It takes forever to get level 4 ports. Forever. Nice. Oh, man. We're throwing a lot of guys in here. That's cool. We need one more artillery. Or one more infantry. Nice. We got some glass. Oh, we can make... Okay, good, 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 good. Actually, I'll probably just put in Pyongyang. It's probably the best place to put it. Machine parts. Thank you. We definitely need that. And I'll put another factory here as well in this area. Because we have built Tohoku up quite a bit. Yeah, we got, let's see, steel, machine parts, and we need coal, which I think we already have coal here, so that's actually really good. We need more capitalists. I could probably use more capitalists, to be honest with you. Good, build that up. Good. Military science, great. Military logistics, even better. More organization. 20, oh, come on, get me. Finish up the construction, hurry up. I want to make battleships. Even though Dreadnoughts are the best in the game, I still want battleships. There we go. Thank God. They take forever to build, though. <clears throat> it costs a lot of money. So, one, two, three, four. I'm going to make four. Let's make four at a time. See what happens. Oh, and that hurt the bank. That definitely hurt us. All right, let's go ahead and begin justifying on Guangxi. We should maybe be able to hold out here. If we have full strength, we might be able to. Chinese people reproducing anymore? Not too much. 
Ooh, Dragoons, that's cool. Don't really need them right now, but, you know, whatever. How's this looking? AP, very good, very good. Oh, look, North Borneo is becoming much more bureaucratic, or has more bureaucrats, which is good for us. A couple Japanese people down here. That's great. Japanese Borneo definitely needs more bureaucrats, like, pretty much everywhere else. Come on, build, build, build. Are we building another military unit in here? Doesn't look like it, so we need another infantry, I believe. There we go. If, actually, before we go to war, you know what we could do? Oh, we could create a state in Kiribati. Cool, yeah. Darn, has to be a free state. We don't believe in slavery. What are you talking about? Can I core? Oh, I can't. Oh, I can't core these areas. Or I keep coring. I play too much Hoi Four, like I say. Um, colonize that other C word. Uh, still not enough range. Oh yeah, Hawaii is part of us. Who owns this? Uh, Ecuador, that makes sense. Peru, it's over there. Uh, what's going on in this area? Oh, when can we core Hawaii? Ah, uh, nah, state, statify, give them statehood. Yeah, statehood, statehood. That's that's what that's where I'm looking for. Long. Oh, yap. Where's yap? It's like almost like a nap. Nice. I mean, there's like no one else here. There's like 2,000 guys on the island, but you know, whatever. They're kind of Micronesian, but that's cool. That's alright. And we make sure that everyone likes us to a degree. Yes. Uh, they're rank 2. Hey, they're number 1 in military. Actually, Germany is rank 1 in industry, of course. Makes sense. And military is 2. America is... Well, America. France is not doing so well. They're rank 1 in prestige, which is kind of strange, but they're rank 7 in both industry and military. Japan on 5th. I have a higher score than Russia. I mean, I can continue to fake friendliness. Their industry looks really bad. Actually, who's... Yeah. Ainu is an accepted... Hmm, culture. Cool. Uh, British. Oh, yeah, they got Dixon. Dixon. Dixie. Texan. Cherokee. Afro-American. You guys have French, French, Canadian. Italy's here. Cool. Bavaria, you have to die, man. I don't like you being up that high. No problem lines with you? No. And it looks like we got some unemployed people. That's not good. That's really, really not good. Nice. Good stuff. Good stuff. More artillery attack. And we've done it. We have done it. Do we have a battleship yet? No. Let us go ahead and justify on Guangxi. They are allied with Burma and Siam. That's actually not good for us. Burma... So, hmm. I'm going to assume we're only going to be able to take one tile away from these guys, which is fine. Because of all the war score that's going to need to happen. Actually, with Burma, are, are they in anyone's sphere? They are in the British sphere. I really hope that the British do not get involved. It's a liberated country, but that costs more. Just a man concession. Good. Good. This battleship squadron we want to make should do really well. Okay, so what's... Man, that's costing us a lot. Holy cow. Luxury furniture. It's fine. Yeah, I might need to raise tariffs back up a little bit more. Guangxi? Eh, that's not too bad. Ottoman Empire. Oh, wait, they have rebels in there. Nice, nice. Honestly, if they, if they break free, I really don't care too much. Rubber? More rubber? Great. Like a little bit more, more money for us, for the federal government. Well, it's probably not even a federal government, it's just a government. Uh, they have rebels, actually. Where do they have rebels? Uh, I think the Ottomans have, have it under control. Nice. This will come in handy, especially as we're trying to fight off thousands of southern Chinese men. Good. al Arish. Actually, let's take politics decisions. Can I build the Suez Canal? I need machine tools. Once we have machine tools, I can build the Suez. And that'll be a great thing. Oh, it's pause. No wonder nothing's happening. Uh, mission to Guangxi. Very good, very good. Take your time. I, it's, we're still, you know, trying to lower our infamy, which is relatively high. Ah, there we go. So by January, we need to go to war. Can we have a ship here, please? They're only halfway. In June, we're going to have a ship. So in January... Oh, the Marshall Islands. Great. They should be Japanese cores. Let's be real. 
Okay, not too bad there. Definitely could use some improvement there. Down here, definitely could use more improvement as well. Oh, they're almost done here, which is great. North Borneo. Grievous Insults. Uh, that's fine. I'm not interested in fighting you guys right now. Great! Fiji! Tonga. Great. Can I create something here? Nope. Colonizing that area. It's a little hard sometimes to see what places have been colonized, what places haven't been. Let's see, that's Australia. Uh, no beef with Australia right now. They look like they are secondary power. It looks like that's pretty much it. And the British did take Russia and Alaska and then allied them, which makes no sense. Serbia. Oh. Uh. Uh, sure, Ethiopia. Oh, Russia. Why are you trying to kill off Asia? And then again, I'm doing the same thing, so no one talk about that. We're number three in military size. Nice. Very nice. Let's see, where are we? Oh! Two battleships! Did I take this off yet or not? I did not take this off. That was a dumb idea. Nope. No wonder I was looking for these ships. Two battleships should be enough to blow up anything that the Chinese have. I'm really trying to make sure our army's, like, amazing, obviously. Oh, more pop growth? Great. Lose militancy? Great. Have you made? Good. Just come on over here and do that. You guys can actually come down here then. Great! Oh, wait. I forgot. You guys come up here. I need that 60 stack. You all are going to actually move right there. And... They are there. Great. You guys are going to help defend and actually destroy... Establish a penal colony. Great. So, isolating offenders and breaches of the public peace from society in general is probably as old as time itself. No one escapes from Azale's Atoll. More humane solutions? Come on. Come on, buddy. Demobilize. Mobilize. Oh, they just cut him down to, cut him down to size. Huh. Yeah, Pyongyang, you're going to get a lot of support, man. Uh, I just clicked on that. What am I doing? What am I doing? Percent. That's fine. Good, good, good. Let's go ahead and start raising this up. It's, we're going to need more money. Oh, I don't want to do this. Guangxi grants extra territoriality or something. Great. Let's see. Defense spending. We're losing a little bit of money. Raise it up by a little bit. Education is doing pretty well. I don't want to lower my name. Oh, wow. What is this? On construction? Set it to 80%. That should help us a little bit more. Hmm. Naval spending just a little bit less. That'd be good. We're making... Eh. That's basically how as best it is. So right now we are exporting... We're importing quite a bit of coal. We need more coal. My bad. Drinking a little bit more tea. So give us about until November, and then we'll go to war with the Chinese. Great. Partially westernized? Well, we better kill them off before they westernize. Man, oh, wait. What, what do we want to even take? We could take down here. Or we could take down here. I want to take down here. I think Hainan might be the... Eh, let's double check our RGOs. What's valuable down here? They have some timber. Uh, actually, check regions. They have a little bit of silk. Oh, that's okay. Timber. That area is okay. If I want to take this area, they have some coffee. They've got coffee. Got oh my god, this is like oh tea. They got a lot of tea. <sighs> Population wise, I really want to connect these areas as much as possible, and I don't want the Russians to take it. So I might just take Fujian because just has more population. Let's take Fujian probably. Ooh, who's oh, rebels? Maximum growth. Uh, you know what? Whatever. I'm, not, I'm gonna let that be okay. There's a lot of Japanese communists. Um, I don't like that. I really don't like that. Can I call my allies in? Uh, everyone but Manchuria. 
You know what? So be it. If Metroid doesn't want to join me, so be it. Yep, and America's joined. Great. I'm gonna move you up. I'm gonna move you right there. Oh, uh, you guys can hold. Good. You guys move up. Uh, it says war. Oh, is that their? Oh, that must be their capital. Nice. Uh, you guys move up. Yeah, that'd be fine. Cool. Oh, we're with Burma. I don't know over there, guys. You'll be fine. Very nice. And we're blockading them. We're completely blockading them. That's really good. Just a casual 1,600 men lost like that. 17,000, 23,000. Very nice. I'm going to let them both siege that down for now. And if they want to leave, I mean, I guess they have the option to. We just got to keep an eye on this. That's all. Very nice. That's a lot of guys around us. <sighs> Fine, Mentoria. We'll do that for now. Cool. Not bad. I want to fight you. You, me, together again. Just in case, do that. Like you go there and come back over here. You swing around, you come around here. That'd be cool. Awesome. Let's go ahead and kill these guys off. Great. Take none. And who's rebels? Oh, the Ottomans. Uh, that's pretty normal. They left? What? What? How dare you leave? Casually destroyed 70,000 men. Holy cow. Nice. Uh, good, 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 good. Very nice. Can I actually fight this battle? Oh my god. I just lost 7,000 versus 65,000 men. You are heading over this way. You should do okay. I'm going to send you guys just in case. You guys come that way. Siege, siege, siege. Tongo region. Very nice, very nice. Oh, is that another? No. That was what we have. Oh, they're trying to siege us. Ah. The old flip the switch. I see. Come here, here, here. Here, here. there you go. Actually, can we get peace with you yet? Probably not. Oh, yeah. Sure, why not? Make it easy on us. Awesome. I'm going to keep you guys in the back for now. You guys come there. You guys come there. There you go. You guys head to port. Lower these guys for now and lower that as well. Make more money for now. Cool. Ting Su. Make sure you build lots of railroads. We're going to build a port right here. You guys stay up north. Actually, you stay right there. We might take out the Chinese right there. And the 60,000 army? Well, it'll be kind of like right here. Oh, and you four? Uh, probably best if I send you out there, maybe. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see what happens. You guys are great. Okay, come back here. Great, great, great. We didn't even get steel breach loaded stuff yet. Mm. But we do need more cheap iron. We need more coal, coal production because we're actually we were importing for a while a lot of it. And we're still importing a lot of coal. So we can reduce dependency on foreign coal and use our own coal. We're gonna make Japan great. Four armies down here really isn't much. But whatever. Nice, we guys need some time to heal up. That's fine. Our literacy rate is over 90%. That's so good. So good. Oh, good, you're down here in North Borneo. Send you down here because they actually want more bureaucrats down here, which is actually good for us. So eventually we can core the states, hopefully, and we might be able to assimilate other people here. Maybe, maybe not. But man, we're researching cheap iron so fast. I love having all of these research points. What percentage of North Borneo is Japanese? 10%, that's not bad. Lazy natives, of course, need to learn to adapt. Pretty normal stuff, pretty easy. Uh, even more cheap steel. Alright, so our top export now is fruit. I guess we don't have enough fruit in the world. We're still importing coal, but... Uh, okay, now it's gone up to coal again. That's okay, we're going to be extracting more and more and more. I do want to lower our 
Uh, infamy, though. That's good. It's always good to do. Oh, there's more. Well, let's see. That's good. A meeting of three. Huh. This incident has, for all its absurdity, shown the sweeping extent to which the government can control everyday life in Japan. Get more consciousness. Lose militancy. I don't mind a little bit more consciousness, maybe. Make more people more aware. That, I guess, is okay, I suppose. I don't know. I think cruisers are also okay to build. So, let's build some cruisers. Because we want dreadnoughts. The battleships are okay. Dreadnoughts are where it's at. Cruisers, I believe, are screened. Which would be North America. Hawaii. Nice. One, two, three, four. Build six, maybe? I don't know. Uh, cost quite a bit of money. That's okay. Everything's going to cost quite a bit of money. Pyongyang. Pyongyang. Alright, so Pyongyang. I could encourage craftsmen. I could, but if I go to war with the Chinese Empire, I, uh, I have to invade through here, which... Yeah, that would be okay, I suppose. They're uncivilized, which is fine with us. Demand concessions. I want to take this whole section. Uh, that's okay, we'll do that. We're gonna need Ningbo, though. U9, looking pretty good. I need to replace these ships eventually, too. We gotta keep that in mind, too. Uh, U14, you can probably, you know, not stay in that one. I might just delete that army, actually. Good, let them go on. Let's get some more cheap steel. I love it cheap. Cheap, 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 cheap. 24 ships. Advanced metallurgy. It is almost 1890. Need more magicism, actually. Uh, digging cap. More defense for everyone. That's pretty good. Railroad, transport troops. Eh, we haven't done that one yet. That's pretty cheap to do. Very nice. Oh, oh yeah. More ports. I forgot about you. Huh. And how is the Middle East doing? Our Middle Eastern concept uh, stuff. Gonna build stuff down there. Okay. Suez is looking pretty decent. Pretty darn decent. They don't really like us there too much, I guess. Makes sense, I suppose. Djibouti's doing alright. No one really wants to live in Djibouti, and I kind of understand. China. That. Nice, nice. Would it be possible for us to build another army here in Japan? Probably not. But another army in Korea might be feasible. Uh, maybe not. Yeah, maybe not yet. Nice, more digging cap, which means we need even more forts. It's been a while since I've actually wanted to get more forts. Build it up. It's going to cost us so much to build all these forts. It takes so much money. That's alright. Give me all of the world's steel. Excellent. Lose more militancy. That's great. Oh, do you have a port? Oh, you have a port up there, but it's already level 4. Great. Portimosa. <clears throat> Excuse me. Very nice. Let time go on. We're still making some money, which is great. Love making the monies. Steel production, good. I forgot we do have this little area too. It is what it is. Costing three hundred thousand to put forts everywhere. Gotta love spamming forts. You guys are doing well. Uh, Tahiti. More Tahiti. Omen. Oh, nice. So we can go to war by July. Just a little bit more. Ah, we actually weren't even caught. That's great. Good. Build that there. Uh, what's going on with you guys? We got enough diplomacy. Oh, they are liberal party. Cool. What's this? Just a little bit more opportunists. Italy, Russia for now. They're seven. Wow, they're really not doing that great. They're number two in military though. It's not bad. So what did I say? 
Wait, France declared war on Transvaal. So, by July. We have to go to war by July. Uh, oh, lower militancy in Hawaii, I suppose. Not bad. Point defense. Even more forts. Deep defense. Trench systems. More defense, more defense, more attack. Uh, let's get some naval professionalism. It's been a while since I've picked on any naval techs. So by July, we must go to war. Persia. Oh, there's... Rebels in Persia. Eh, they should have that. That's not really too much of a problem. Anything here? Important? No? Cool. Good. Don't want to deal with that. So, armies I'm going to need to use. Where's my navy? Oh, they're still over here. I'll come right here. So by July... Don't need to raise my morale just up yet too much. Throw you guys in the boat. Come right there. I'm going to probably take... Uh, well, actually. That should be enough for China right there. We need more armies than just this, though. Hmm. I might use some of Korean armies, too. That's okay. You guys can hear them. That'd be good. So by July. Pyongyang? Absolutely. And if we want to make sure that we have enough stuff in Pyongyang... Colonial incident. That's fine. Don't want to piss them off too much. Basically, military production in Pyongyang is going to be the most important thing. Nice. And naval professionalism is going up very quickly. Culture. Anything else? Advanced metallurgy and changeable parts. Uh, practical steam engine. We might as well do that, at least a little bit. We are ranked two in the world now for military stuff. That doesn't mean I want to go to war, though. Oh, we just unlocked great wars. Oh, God, that's not good. That's interesting. Oh, God, if I want to navally invade, I'm going to attack that area. Chengdu. Chengde. All right, let's go ahead and... Ally the Ottomans? Is that worth it? Uh, sure, why not? America's ally to them. We're, you know, we're like a big old block here of powers, I suppose. Oh, hell yes. Hell yes. Yeah, give me the Germans. Yeah. Okay, so this is kind of weird. We don't have Austria with us, but it's Germany, me, Ottoman Empire, and the United States. Probably versus Russia, the UK, France, and Austria. Because Germany would be easily able, relatively easily should be able to take out Austria. If I can, we can, like, smack the Russians... On both sides. That... Oh, this is not good, though. It's it's like a powder keg. Oh, that's such a powder keg. Oh, God. So, I should probably be ready for war at any time against any of these guys. So, we might want to do this quickly. Raise the budget up. It's going to cost us a ton of money. I don't want to hurt my... So we could probably lower this down just by a little bit more. Lower this just by a little bit more. Yeah, we're going to take maybe a little bit of hit in budget-wise. What? No, France. France. Yeah, I immediately do that. Give a little bit more time. Let's let get our guys enough. Nice defense. Long live Japan. Line Island's great. Give us a little bit more time to get more morale for our soldiers first. Because they're almost there. Uh, the Connor. That sounds like an Indian nation. Uh, I'm okay. We're going to not do that yet. I'm going to go to war before anything gets too bad. Cool. And at the beginning of May, we should go to war. Good. Alright. Sounds like a great time to get home. Oh, wait. Did we lose? Oh, they might have western... They westernized. God dang it. Oh, it's going to cost us so much political power now. God dang it. Now we can't go to war because China finally westernized. That's not spend too much on our military just for now. Ah, uh, China, god dang it. Uh, I just wanted this area. I hate when the Chinese westernize. But now they're they're just so weak still. It doesn't even matter. Squang Z's partially westernized. Really? Really, guys? Why are you fighting over the Ottomans so much? Good. More coal production. Of course. More simulation rate. Minority building restrictions. 
Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. UK, increase relations. Oh no, who are they war with? They're fighting the Brits. Can I manage to fight the Brits? Oh, this is going... Oh, this might, this might turn into a great war. You know what? You know what? With the North German Federation, the United States, the Ottomans, and me... We should be able to do okay. But, you know what? we got to end the episode there because we're up 40 minutes in. So, anyways, guys. I hope you enjoyed his, today's episode because we became the second largest military on the Earth. We're ranked fourth in production or industry, ranked fifth in prestige, which I've really not messed with at all. But, anyways, Africa looks terrible. But, if you enjoyed today's episode, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we try to fight a war against the goddamn British. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.